Ooh. Barth? Okay, Barth's the pick. All right, Barth's the pick for Wompy. Wompy going with a classic for sure. Unless that's Mysterica, which would be really funny, but I'm pretty sure Mysterica is on her, her tried and true Palutena here. All All right. Semi-finals here, another two out of three set. I'm curious to see how Wompy plays this Marth. Marth is such a cool character, highly underrated as well. He has so many cool, like, unique combos that not a lot of other characters have. So I want to see how Wompy can utilize this to effect. Well, let's see what Mysterica can do as well, because Palu Atena, like, traditionally doesn't do that well versus swords. So this well, could be bad. Marth is definitely one of those I know that you know characters. If he can, you know, get catch a read on what you're doing, he gets so much mileage just off one interaction. And I love this mix coming out from Wompy, just baiting on the shield. He has great parry from Mysterica. Honestly, one of the only options you can go for when that shield breaker comes out. Absolutely. And Mysterica capitalizing off that interaction just a little bit. Getting a little saucy here with that down air. You see the fade back from, <laughs> um, from Wompy, though? Just narrowly avoiding that down air from Mysterica. Now Mysterica has to make her way back to the ledge. Yep. And she does. Both these players very aware of how potent the ledge options are. And if there's one thing you can take away from watching Wampi is how he utilizes his movement. It just, on every character he plays, he is moving around all the time. I love watching him move. Look yep. at him. Look at him stutter step. Now Mysterica finding a quick little nair for herself. Ledge trap situation. What's the option? Great back air from Mysterica. Now can you cover the recovery though? No tech. Able to make it back though. Mysterica stuck at the ledge now. Can we get out of this? I feel like Wompy was actually covering the neutral get up there, just a little off time there with the four tail. Okay. Seems like we're just dancing around on this right side of the stage, trying to find the kill option. Great movement from Mysterica as well. Utilizing that platform to her own effect. And trying to make their way out of this. Oh, we still right haven't lost a stock yet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're playing some new cheer, Lucas. I appreciate it. Ooh, that side B, but the, the air dodge was given away by Mysterica, but Wompy not ready for it. Able to air dodge through the explosive flame. Marth will snap the ledge with the up B. That's going to be a back throw. Advantage state for Marth. Ledge trap. I like that. A fade back with the teleport was great for Mysterica. That's a throw. Oh, I like the ledge, like the release actually. That was good. Mash out with the nair coverage for Mysterica. Going to close out that first stock. And that was almost a two and a half minute stock. My goodness. We're in it to win it here. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're playing some. some Serious Smash Brothers right now. Yep. All right, you know, we got Mysterica here pressing that advantage just a little bit more, already getting a sizable chunk of, uh, yep. you know, lead here. And you see Mysterica utilizing the, the fainting movement of Palu, able to come in and out of combat with the teleport, with the dashes. That re-grab is going to be punished by the down I was ready for that. <laughs> Wampy was looking to punish that teleport, wasn't quite ready to do it. And Mysterica finding herself with even more percentage, 65%, 79, and climbing the explosive flame. Ooh, that was a great early up, but a great tech from Mysterica as well. The explosive flame once again not going to connect. That side B able to cover the nair. Oh my P doing such a great job in disadvantage. Yeah, he was very close to just losing it Ooh, all here. That was so close. We almost had a Dragon Ball Z moment right there. I'm, I'm a big fan. All right. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know if they can make it back this time. We're having a classic case of Marthitis right now, but even the weak kid will do it that far into the blast zone. Great Wompy coverage. able to find that first kill, able to dodge the explosive flame once again. Wompy making their way back to the level, trying to get center, but Sterka not having any of it. Nope. And the up tilt will do cut, it. Cut, catch the jump, absolutely. Yep, she goes up two stocks to one. Wompy, how are you going to make yourself come back into this game? Quick little side B, that's 14%. I think if Mysterica takes this game, I don't think Wompy sticks with Marth. This is only two out of three. You don't have a ton of room to play with. Yep, you really do not have a ton of room to play with. Forward air out of disadvantage from Wompy, trying to get away from this blast zone. Mysterica has been doing such a good job of keeping Wompy at bay. You now, Mysterica stuck at the ledge. Wompy trying to find his way in, but first option from... These, these dash attacks are just paying in dividends. Well, Mysterica right also, now. Mysterica just gaining so much off the straight hit. Did he jump? Did he make That's it back? It. No, he can't. And that was a great edge guard for Mysterica. She goes up in that first game. That was a convincing first game. <laughs> so I don't know if the, I don't think the Marth is sticking around after that. Well, it that was one. really close in the first stock. Like it, it seemed like they were both just trying to find that first kill, and then Mysterica all of a sudden opened up one P, and that that first stock was a game changer for her. I think. Yeah, but. I'm really curious where Wompy's going now. This is off, actually, uh, on this specific mod pack, Wompy generally picks this song. So I think, uh, are we get the ditto here? 
No, Banjo. And there's the Banjo like I talked about earlier. Maybe Wampy's going to pick it. Yeah, he is. Doesn't want to elect for the Palu due to an understandably so. Sometimes you just don't want to deal with the, having to fight the same character. Um, but the Banjo and Kazooie coming out for Wampy. Let's see how they can utilize it. That grenade does 15%. That's some crazy damage. I didn't know that. Some DLC damage right there. For <laughs> like a, pretty much a non-DLC character otherwise. Hey, man, Banjo actually needs it, though. <laughs> Genuinely. Now, Sterica finding themselves with a quick Nair string into the up air as well, 52%. Not bad for Mysterica, but now Wompy looking to find some sort of opener. Has center stage control, but Sterica just fainting around on this right side. She's totally comfortable on this right side blast zone. Just doesn't want to give up too much percent just to claim stage. She's okay just chilling out over here, but Wampy is setting up a, a wall of projectiles. Yep, and I think it's good that they're opting for projectiles more so because I felt like Mysterica was winning a lot of the close interactions in the last game. Yep. So kind of pepper her just a little bit with some projectiles and then, then uh, capitalize on one mistake like that. Going off stage, this is going to be very dire if he gets, an if he gets another follow-up yep. of Mysterica recovering at the last second. Mm -hmm. Wonder Ring, so laggy. Going to have to see a punish every time if that Wonder Ring does not find his proper mark. Great parry from Mysterica yeah. and the drag down Nair into the up tilt. Not quite going to confirm we're going to see an up air. Nope. Looks like the explosive flame and the forward air. Big punch from Banjo and Kazooie will find the first stock. Yep. Mysterica trying to not let that stock linger on too, more, uh, too much going for the up air right there, but Wampy being able to cover it just a little bit, bring back the stage, and now already putting him in a ledge trap. Oh, yep. oh, never mind, dead. Great explosive flame. Mysterica been so good with sniping out with the explosive flame on Palutena, but Wompy does have a slight lead here. That'll be a grab. Nice forward, forward air from Mysterica, finding a little bit more percent for herself. The down tilt actually covers a lot of space for Wompy. That down tilt is kind of hard to deal with sometimes if you're not ready for it. Huh? Mysterica not being able to get out of the situation, but already kind of losing a little bit more health. Kind of try to play the projectile game back. You know, a little bit of a punish on an overextension right there. Yep. So back and forth, reflecting the little egg. Yeah. From Zooey. Didn't do a whole lot but give her some uh, state control there, but hey, you know, already getting the lead just again right here. Yeah, and it's just it's just hit for hit right now. Nobody can find a huge lead, but confirming after the reflector on the grenade, smart, smart stuff from Hysterica there. Yep. The Wonder Wing gonna come right through. Wompy bulldozing their way onto center stage, now setting up the projectiles once again. Mysterica kind of getting a little bit more comfortable with projectiles this time around. I don't feel like they feel very pressured at the moment. Wompy yep. kind of, I feel like, is using it to give himself time to think. But Mysterica, she's already, you know, about to take that other stock, but Wompy makes it back. Yep. Wonder, Wonder Wing, Wing a little bit bad. Kind of call it a jump there, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The forward air has two more Wonder Wings left. That's a big punish. I didn't know that jab could actually almost kill. Close and Flame not going to find its mark, but one Wonder Wing left. Or Wampy and gonna be able to use it to oh my, wow. he gets the stock with that full screen and it went through the shield too. That is so clutch. I can't believe the last Wonder Wing was able to find that stock as well. Clutch as ever is Wampy now. Sterica has to figure out a way to get back into this game by finding this kill, which shouldn't be too long for this world because 148% on the banjo, a lot of things can kill at this Absolutely. point. Absolutely. Mysterica also still with the game lead, so a little bit more time to think things out through if Wompy decides to stick with this banjo if he's able to clutch this game out. Mm -hmm. Nair's going to send Wompy off the side once again. Wompy electing to go high, utilizing the grenade explosion to keep themselves ambiguous, able to use the down air, but Mysterica just so patient, waiting for their moment to strike, and they do, and she finds that second stock for herself, and now a little bit of an advantage state for herself as well. Yep, Wampy uh, really struggling against these platforms against uh, you know Palutena right here. It's just so it's so hard for Banjo to kind of deal with that. But like I said, that oh, oh my, okay. where are we going, <laughs> Wampy? Utilizing two Wonder Wings out in the blast zone, trying to cover even more from Mysterica, but Mysterica able to make her way back. Now this right blast zone, Mysterica has been chilling here for a majority of this game so far because they don't want to give up too much just to get center. They're okay with Wampy throwing out all these projectiles as long as it doesn't get them killed. Yep, the slow methodical approach was working very well. You know, hopefully he can chip some damage back right here, get in a good situation on the uh, platform right here. And I think Wampy able to recover just a little bit more, but then uh, Mysterica sneaking in that uh, there there to try to follow up with an up there. Yep, Mysterica. Just trying to equalize his percent. That grenade causing a trade to happen. Signs of Snake, perhaps. 
Whenever you hit that grenade, it kind of blows up. A little bit of trades for Banjo. Banjo definitely is heavier than Palutena, so these trades are always going to be good for Wampy. Jericho looking very comfortable now. Okay. Close situation. Wampy no holding in a little bit too much. Wonder Wing to get back to center. Yep. I notice he's been using Wonder Wing a little bit more when his uh, jump option maybe has been taken. Yep. Got to be careful. Both combatants are at very high percents at this point in time. Wampy is being so aggressive at the ledge, trying to... Ooh, that, the, I, I appreciated that quite a bit. Unfortunately, the, the ledge snuck, you know, it just took the momentum away. Yeah, I thought the, the, the ledge is sometimes just, or the platforms rather, sometimes just like glue, just you stick to them. Hysterica looking poised wow. to get this game, but that backer not quite gonna do it. Wampy has to make it back. I think he's got one more, no, I think that was his last Wonder Wing. That might be the last Wonder Wing. Wampy has to work with what he has for this stock. Hysterica trying to get that back throw, and it's so close to killing. Maybe Wampy should have fighting for dear life right now. How are we going to make it back? Utilize the grenade to cover the disadvantage. Wampy, Ooh. Ooh. is that barely going to do it? The forward air does it, and Wampy